it's really windy here, so you might not be able to hear me. Just kidding. <laughs> We're at the Badlands. It's pretty cool. Windy! It's probably buffalo here. Tatanka. Tatanka. <laughs> if any of you have uh, seen that movie with uh, Dancing with Wolves, so that's what I'm referring to that movie. So, we're going to check it out. Pocket and it blew way across the road. Over here somewhere. I don't know, like 30 bucks, I think. Yeah. Did you find any of it? Lost some money. It's happened when you leave money loose in your pocket. So I don't like about American money. Just too many, too many bills. Canada, we have five, ten, fifteen, twenty. Not just like ones. Twenties. So, might find it. We'll keep looking a little bit. Look for five, ten minutes. Can't find it. Can't find it. Maybe one day someone else will find it. And then you really need it. You think so? It's probably stuck somewhere around here. Oh yeah. Keep looking. Pick the camera up in a little bit.
one souvenir. And all those souvenirs. Bought a sticker. Probably lied to you. Bought a cup. She bought one from the dollar store. She bought one from the dollar store. And it's uh, not very good. We're going to try to open this up with one hand. And talk. And pull it out. I think I can do it. Oh yeah. This would be a cool design. It said land back. <laughs> Bad land, land back. Bad land, land back. Land is back. And we're gonna go put it on the cooler. like the only open spot so I think it's going there try and dust it off a little bit it's a little warm Badlands land back land is back and we're gonna go put it on the cooler like the only open spot so I think it's going there try and dust it off a little bit it's a little warm Badlands land back land is back and we're gonna go put it on the cooler the only open spot so I think it's going there try and dust it off a little bit it's a little warm now let's try and stick it try and peel it with one hand Badlands. Ready? Ready. We are in the Badlands. Are you in 
have my like little dead cat thingy it's called. It's like a wind blocker for your sound. You can probably hear the wind. It's just really windy here, so it's gonna come up on the video. Makes it more authentic. Like you're here with me. But you're watching through your screen on YouTube. <laughs> Winter maintenance. Sure it's been covered. Walking the scenic way. I'm gonna walk up here. It's a scenic trail, I think. You can see stuff. Maybe get a better view of the Badlands, I'm guessing. I don't know. So far, so good. Pretty windy here. Uh, here we go. I think you can go up that way. Walk around. That's what we'll do. Just walk up and around. Check it out. Wait for the wind to die down. <laughs> so you can hear me. I think this at this point I'm probably just gonna put sound over because it's really windy right now. Oh pretty cool through these trees here. Oh yeah, so when I was running around looking for my money earlier, we went and uh, I went and Googled, because I know there's rattlesnakes around here. So I Googled rattlesnake, what's rattlesnakes around this area? And they're just um, called prairie rattlesnakes. 
and they don't really, they're not aggressive at all, they're like the least aggressive rattlesnake, and apparently it's like, it's very rare to get bitten by one, um, they're, they're poisonous though, but it's like very rare that you get bitten by them, so, that made me a little bit, I wasn't worried, but just less, I don't know what the word would be, just learned something new. It's pretty cool. I don't even know if you see me the whole time I was walking there. The sun came out behind the clouds, so oh, it's blowing way back out. The sun came up behind the clouds. It just changed my lighting aperture. It's all about controlling the light. Now I get, when I worked in an Atsy, what that meant. Hmm. What kind of bug that is? Or animal? A beetle maybe? Maybe a beetle? Probably could be a beetle. Pretty loud, like one. My car says 38 today. 38 degrees. I'm probably all blown out again. I have my sunglasses on, so it's kind of hard to see the screen. And we're walking up these stairs, getting some exercise, some cardio. less than 60 inches of precipitation per year. A bowl-like cliff shelf where you stand provides more moisture than commonly found in this desolate land. Drawn to the spot for more than 11,000 years, humans have used, this, used the area for everything from ancient hunting, hunting camps to modern lodges. Remains of ancient campfires like this dot. down that way.
nice and cool in the shaded area. <sighs> Getting our cardio in for the day. Nice walking. Should turn on my thing on my Apple Watch, but I wonder what that is. Must be like a marking for something. Uh, surveying. Oh, that's all blown out. It's probably like a marking for surveying or something. Surveyor marks. I don't know. If you know what that is, put that in the comments below. I'd be kind of interesting to see what that is. Even that bug or that noise. I think it's a beetle. I'm pretty sure it's a beetle. But if you know what it is, let us know in the comments. Say, hey, this is what this thing is that's making that noise. But I remember from working in northern Alberta that beetles are really loud. Man. This is nice. That's cool how it goes from like just desert. And then you go down in here and there's like trails and trees. Cedar. I think that's cedar. Pine needles. That's cool. How this just changes so quickly within so many feet. It smells like pine needles. Pretty nice here though. To like know that this was most likely covered underwater at one time, which I'm pretty sure. Like don't don't quote quote these things that I'm saying, don't take them to heart, don't get all mad and offended. And I'm pretty sure like just from like understanding the world and earth and things that the bad canyons were all was underwater, right? And you can see like the water levels. I'm pretty sure. Could be wrong. You know. I'm not always right, and I never will always be right. I will learn to. That's pretty cool. How they have like trails off the beaten track, beaten track. I'm sure, you can go up there and see some good views. We're just gonna keep walking along this trail and talking. Like, look, there's like a mud here. That's mud. That's all dry. So that probably gets more sunlight than this. That's still kind of like wet. Yeah, look at that. It's so fresh still. It's still pretty squishy. So yeah, more mud. Trails, trees. Steps. I'm just telling you things that you already know what they are. <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. And then look, boom, back out to the desert. Well, I don't know if this is a desert. I don't think you'd call this a desert, but it's out in the open and exposed. Just open up. See if there's any bugs on it. Whew. Nice little bench here. It's a pretty cool rock. Take a look at that. How long it took to form that. Interesting. I don't even know how to get back. Another trail down there. And this is true vlogging. Shaking the camera, doing whatever. Just walking. Might be a little shaky the footage. What happens when you're hiking and walking, exercising, moving, feel like 
This is what my ancestors would do during the springtime. They would travel, not, not this area, but like through the Rocky Mountains without roads, without maps, without things like that. A bug that flew in my face, I think. No roads, no maps. They'd, they would walk with horses thousands of kilometers. It's pretty neat. It's pretty much trail to take care of. It's a good reason. They don't winter maintenance it. Just let it go the way it is supposed to go. And just have this piece of wood kind of guides you. Oh, there's two pieces of wood. I, I'm sure that's you get medicine out of that. Honeysuckle? Fur, maybe? There's probably some form of medicine in that. I guarantee it. Oh no, these aren't honeysuckles. This is really, really dry. You know what these are? Tell me what they are in the comments. Let's get these comments rolling. Let me know what they are. So those are, that's like a dandelion looking thing. I've seen berries in some of these bushes. Pop poisonous though. Probably really poisonous. We're gonna walk down this. Four by four. Uh, and back out to the cars. We're gonna jump, jump in the car. We'll drive up through. I think there's another spot you can go to. Like a lookout. And uh, yeah, oh, so I found 10 bucks. If you're wondering, I found that 10 bucks. I lost a 20. So I donated 20 bucks to the Badlands. Maybe one day it'll be found by someone who really needs it. Yeah, we'll never know. We'll never know. So, I'll pick you up when we stop at the next bar.
trail from the visitor center and it's kind of like the same thing but oh wow look up there Rattlesnakes. Let's see, how are you feeling? Why oh, yeah, water here? Still even more. Huh? It's not a stone. It's just a stick. It's a branch. That's easy to put in context of the that's yeah, that's water. It's woo woo. Woo woo. That's how we say it in Tunaka. Look. These are thriving. Sunflowers? Is that sunflower seeds? So, I don't know. City boy, remember? City boy. Oh yeah. Look, those are milk thistles right there. See? Boy knows what he's talking about, kind of. Look, crickets down there. Yeah, this would be like perfect. For rattlesnakes, because there's water nearby. So there's more rodents. Back there, there's not much water around. So I don't know if they really like that area, rattlesnakes. Googled it. They said they like to lie in the grass, bushy grass that is kind of more shaded. And it would make more sense because there's water back there. They would really like that area. That's probably why that sign's there because that's where they see them more. But we're right now, we're walking down a trail. <coughs> Let's go look in the canyon. Way too fast for me. Big review. Oh wow. even a bigger review than I thought of. Ready for it?
this is what I'm looking for. And all of a sudden she's like, saying. <sighs> yeah, put down the camera for a minute and uh, just enjoy it. That's behind the scenes of recording TikToks. Yeah, look, behind the scenes is right. <laughs> the camera person. <laughs> I have a tripod, I just don't know where I put it. It's somewhere in my car. It's like the, you probably can't even hear me right now. So I'll talk right into the microphone. Just kidding. <laughs> but it's like the, it's like just like a black hole. like. It's because you live in it all summer. Well, I live in it all summer. All summer I've been living in it now. And uh, it's Brooke's first week in it. Black hole. In the black, in the black hole. <laughs> I like lost charger for my laptop, the big cube. I'm pretty sure I left that in Billings at Kelly's Inn. A pair of sandals. And two bags that we got from uh, Kihuen, the special, Pavel's of mine, and my selfie stick, and my selfie stick, just kidding, <laughs> it's really windy, so you probably cannot hear me, so I will speak extra loud, <laughs> we're gonna go to the other side now, she left me, she like just scurried off, she was like way down here, and then I was like way over there, and I was like, come here, She's just standing there watching me. Yeah. Oh, she had to turn her. I thought she turned her phone on. Yeah. To go up near the water. Hang out, hang out with the rattlesnakes.
It's like so loud, I don't even know if you'd be able to hear the rattlesnake it's rattle if you're close to one. It's because it's so windy right now. Yeah, it's a pretty cool trip so far. I'm enjoying it. It's called the Window Trail. That's where we are. So if you've been to the Badlands, I guess you know where this is. Um, my first time coming here, so I don't know where anything is. It's just washrooms up there. Oh, we're gonna go off the beaten path now. Again. Oh. Excuse me. Check it out. That concludes our trip to the Badlands. We just finished off at the Badlands Trading Post. Now we're uh, headed off to Shakopee for the weekend for the powwow. So I hope you enjoyed um, this little escapade, little sightseeing moments. Um, wow, all sweaty. <laughs> all sweaty. So, yeah. Thank you for coming along. Have a good one. Everything happens for the right reasons. And we'll see you at Shakopee. Take care.